Fellow, this is Corey Watson with another review. Today I'm gonna be reviewing Taskmaster. So yeah, I'm seeing you Taskmaster. So yeah, his design looks nice. Very nice movie design. I like the dark blue, orange, silver, white, the hood. <coughs> Very nice movie design right here. And the Max doesn't look bad, it looks like a skull. Very nice. Very nice, so yeah. I already read this bio. But you know I'm gonna read it one more time. Taxmaster is, is on with the ability to mimic an enemy's every movement. So pretty much in the original Venture comics there was this kid he had this ability when he was younger when he sees something moving he could picture it and completely copy. So, yeah. And that's why he has all those accessories. And he's a very good martial artist and acrobatics expert as well. He could shoot arrows like Hot Guy, throw his shield like Captain America, and he's a very good sword fighter. And he also has very sharp claws. He might be able to copy. Black Panther's movements as well. This movie design looks nice. He is part of the Black Widow movie wave. Or do you have another character that's a part of that wave? He has a school that he trains supervillain young he trains supervillain youngsters in his school. And cross I'll tell you that soon, you know. Already showed you his nice design. So yes, he could move his arms out, rotate all the way 360, bend at the elbow all the way like that. Move his wrist, ball joint and stuff, swivel at the arm. Stuff. He could also move his head. Well, not all the way because the these pieces are in the way. He can't bend back that forward, and he can't move his head up that far. But because he had this whole hood piece and stuff. Burger King? Will we be able to get White Castle? What? No? Okay, Burger King. Huh? We can? What? White Castle is an hour away. Yeah, I feel this way. Two weeks. That's a big relief. Oh yeah, you gotta do his way next. Okay, 
so he could move his leg up that far and back that far, bend at the knee. CJ's first came to final decision. So we can't do White Castle? No. All right, yes. He could bend his leg that far. There's no Swiss rotation that. There's a, he could move his leg. That's it. Not a ball. He could move his leg like this. There's no swivel at the fire or something. But he could bend his waist down that far. And back that far. And waist rotation all the way from 60. So, yeah. But this, but this arm right here is like a little bit bent. That's all. But still ain't a bad figure. You could still move this arm as well. Yeah, you could still move it. It's not that bad. But then it does that. So yeah, he isn't a bad figure. Now his accessories, he has these two trigger hands. So remove these fist hands. Got the trigger hands on him, you know. And then he has the shield that has a peg for the back, but there's no hole for him. No hole on the back. But then. But then you have this peg right here that you can put on his hand. And it's cut hold. But then he has his sword. <coughs> so yes, he has his sword and shield. Very nice. Accessories he has. Very excited that I got this video. Yep. He's going to take down the hills now with his great sword shields and defense. Yeah. What you want? Uh, two. what you want on your whopper? Whopper the double. What do you want on it? Um, pickle, mayonnaise, ketchup, lettuce. I'm gonna tell them everything except tomatoes. Yeah, I want tomatoes too.
Can I get? Could I get some fries in the drink? It's a bundle. We all get fries, but no drink. No. Because, you know, it's kind of, he said it's kind of disgusting. What? Because the Uber eats me. Probably might take a sip and say, here you go, <laughs> sir. What? you have a seriously doesn't have a time. So yeah, you got the sword and stuff, you know. Let's see how it rolls on the other hand. doesn't hold the other hand bad, you know? Very nice sword skills and stuff. Then he has like... So yeah, he has a bow and arrow. So yeah, I was able to hold it like this so he has a bow and arrow. Very nice bow and arrow. Looks realistic. And he has this school like bow tip. That's what he got, school like bow tip. So yeah. Very nice design, have orange tape at the two ends. So yeah, time to like switch off his hands. And then he has these like two claw hands. Very nice. Very nice claw hands features. You might be able. You might be able to copy the black hair for now. Very nice, right here. So yeah. Now time for some toy comparisons. Well, the only toy comparisons I have right now, since I'm at Pennsylvania, you know. 
So yes, we have him and Red Ranger, Dino Charge Red Ranger. Then we have First Order Disguise, Finn. And then we have his like wave mate. Costumes. He's a lot more bigger. So if you enjoyed this figure, <coughs> if you want them, if you like the MCU movies, I advise you to get them. He's a very awesome figure. He only has one flaw, is this, that's it. I give him, I say, like 9 out of 10, just like that. He's a very awesome figure. And he's might be, he's going to be on the top 10 list of 2020 figures. He's going to be there with some other Marvel figures as well. So yeah, please like, comment, subscribe, see you guys later.